To create a new session, for Windows, press Ctrl N. For Mac, press Command N. To create a new track, for Windows, press Ctrl Shift and N. For Mac, press Command Shift and N. To turn the metronome on and off, press number 7 on the numeric keypad. But first, you have to create a click track. To start recording, for Windows you have three different shortcut keys, Control Spacebar, F12, or Numeric Keypad 3. For Mac, Command Spacebar, F12, or Numeric Keypad 3. To drop a marker on the timeline, as you record or play, press Enter on the Numeric Keypad. For loop recording on or off, press 5 on the Numeric Keypad. But you need to check one thing first. To place each recording take onto its own playlist, so that they can be viewed and edited simultaneously, go to Setup, Preferences, Operation, and tick the Automatically Create New Playlists when loop recording. To import a new file, for Windows, press Ctrl, Shift, and I. For Mac, press Command, Shift, and I. For Windows, Control and equals switches between the mix and edit windows. For Mac, press Command equals. Use T to zoom in, and use R to zoom out. To zoom in your selection for Windows, press Alt and F. For Mac, press Option and F. Press E to zoom in the selection or to zoom in anywhere your mouse is. But this is a one key shortcut. And to use Pro Tools one key shortcuts, you'll need to turn on keyboard focus mode by clicking the AZ button in the upper right corner of the edit window. If the AZ button is yellow, keyboard focus is on. To reset the zoom, so the entire song fits on the screen, for Windows press Alt and A. For Mac, press Option and A. To increase or decrease track height for any lane that has the cursor in it, for Windows, press Start and up and down arrows. For Mac. Press Ctrl and up and down arrows. Add the Alt key to apply to all tracks. To increase or decrease the amplitude zoom of your tracks, for Windows, press Ctrl, Alt, and the square brackets. For Mac, press Command, Option, and the square brackets. F1 to F4 changes the edit window modes. F5 to F10 changes the edit window tools. Numeric keypad, 0, 1, and 2, can be used to play rewind and fast forward your tracks. For one click shortcuts, turn on keyboard focus mode, press on the AZ button. A, to trim clip start, to cursor. S, to trim clip end, to cursor. D, to fade clip from start, to cursor. F, to cross fade clips without opening the dialog. G, fade out from cursor to end of clip. To split a clip or to cut a selection, for Windows, press Ctrl E. For Mac, press Command E. To keep only the selection and trim the rest of the clip, for Windows, press Ctrl T. For Mac, Press Command T. To duplicate a selection or a clip, for Windows, press Control D. For Mac, press Command D. To strip silence, for Windows, press Control U. For Mac, press Command and U. To unite clips together in one clip, select them and press Alt. Shift and 3. For Mac, press Option Shift and 3. To heal separation, for Windows, select the area and press Ctrl H, but it doesn't work on relationships. For Mac, it's Command H. To create a mix group, select the tracks, and for Windows, press Ctrl G. For Mac, press Command G. Solo, mute, and volume change of any of them will affect all within the group. This can speed up your workflow. 
select the tracks that you want to submix, and change their output. To apply to all at once, for Windows, press Alt and Shift, for Mac press Option and Shift, then go to any of the tracks you selected and change its output. Choose New Track, choose the Type Auxiliary Input, name it, press Create. To insert a plugin effect on multiple tracks at once, select the tracks you want, press Alt and Shift for Windows, or press Option and Shift for Mac, then go to any of the tracks and choose the plugin that you want. It will be applied to all the tracks you selected. To nudge a clip, to move it slightly left or right, select the clip with the grabber tool, and use the plus and minus keys on the numeric keypad. Change the nudge value, so you can move the clip in smaller or bigger increments. To nudge trim the left border of an audio clip, for Windows, press Alt and minus or Alt and plus, on the numeric keypad. For Mac, it's Option and minus or Option and plus. To nudge trim the right border of an audio clip, for Windows, press Control and minus or Control and plus, on the numeric keypad. For Mac, press Command and minus or Command and plus, on the numeric keypad. To lock an audio clip, for Windows press Ctrl L. For Mac, press Command L. To bounce a track, select it, and for Windows, press Ctrl, Alt, Shift and B. For Mac, press Command, Option, Shift and B. To bounce a song to disk, for Windows, press Ctrl Alt and B. For Mac, it's Command Option and B. If you unlink Timeline and Edit Selection, you can have the Playback and Edit Selection separately. But, if you want them to match, just press letter O or zero, depending on which one you want to move. If you want your fader to go back to zero, for Windows, press Alt and click on the fader. For Mac, press Option and click on the fader. Fader showing zero, it's called Unity Gain. To ungroup tracks, Press on any fader within the group, and then, for Windows, press Ctrl, Shift and G. For Mac, it's Command Shift and G. To solo save tracks, so when you solo another track, they will not mute. For Windows, press Ctrl and click on the solo buttons of the tracks. For Mac, it's Command and click on the solo buttons. To bypass many or all plugins on a track, for Windows, press Start key and click on the plugin. It will bypass all the plugins underneath. For Mac, Control and click on Plugin. To bypass multiple plugins in a row from different tracks, for Windows, press Control, Alt and click on Plugins. For Mac it's Command, Option, and click on Plugins. To bypass only one plugin at a time, for Windows, press Ctrl and click on the plugin. For Mac, it's Command and click on the plugin. To deactivate all the plugins on a row, for Windows, press Ctrl, Start, Alt and press on one plugin. All in that row will be deactivated. To activate them back, press again. For Mac, it's Command, Ctrl, Alt and press on a plugin. If you want a plugin to be copied on another track, for Windows, press Alt and drag it where you want. For Mac, it's Option and drag the plugin with your mouse. To move an audio clip to another track without moving it earlier or later by mistake, for Windows, press Start and drag it with your mouse. It will have exactly the same position on the timeline. For Mac, press Control and move the track. Mouse scroll moves the view up and down through the tracks. If you press shift, the movement will change to left and right. To change automation value by small increments, for Windows, press start, shift, and up and down arrows. For Mac, press control, shift, and up and down arrows. To change the clip gain nudge value, go to setup, preferences editing, and change it.
To play back at half speed, press shift and spacebar. To record at half speed, press shift and F12. If you find this useful, subscribe now and see you next time. If a lot of people love each other, the world would be a better place to live. Thank you.